as the median nerve courses down the arm, it can be scanned in four different positions. First, at the mid-arm, followed by just above cubital fossa, then at the cubital fossa, and finally at the mid-forearm. We begin the scan in position 1. Here, the median nerve lies laterally to the brachial artery at the mid-arm. Upon a distal scan, it can be seen transversing over the top of the artery to lie on its medial aspect just above the cubital fossa. In this scan at the mid arm, the median nerve can be seen lying laterally to the brachial artery while the ulnar nerve lies medial to the brachial artery. Upon a distal scan, the ulnar nerve is slowly seen to move medially while the median nerve remains along with the brachial artery. Subsequently, the median nerve transverses over top of the artery to come and lie on its medial aspect as can be seen here. Continuation of scan of median nerve from position 2 to position 3 at cubital fossa reveals its relative medial position as compared to brachial artery and that it lies below or medial to the tendon of the biceps brachii. In this image, the median nerve can be seen lying medial to brachial artery as well as the bicep tendon. However, it lies superficially to the brachialis muscle. Let's now have a look at an example of median nerve block at the elbow. In the image shown, the median nerve lies very close to the basilic vein on its lateral side and the brachial artery can also be seen. A block needle is introduced from lateral to medial aspect over the top of brachial artery to come in close proximity to the median nerve as shown here. A circumferential injection of 3 to 5 ml of local anesthetic is made to effect the median nerve block. Finally, a continued scan of the median nerve from position 3 to position 4 reveals the positioning of median nerve between the flexor digitorum superficialis and flexor digitorum profundus. In this image, the median nerve can be seen sandwiched between these two muscles. Finally, a block needle is brought in to close contact with the median nerve in a medial to lateral orientation and a small volume of 3 to 5 ml of local anesthetic is deposited in a circumferential manner around the median nerve to effect its block. 